What's going on everyone? Today we are at Savi's Workshop here in Galaxy's Edge located in Disney's Hollywood Studios. Actually, not in Galaxy's, not in Disney's Hollywood Studios. From Black Spire Outpost on the planet Batu. Anyways, today we are at Savi's Workshop and I'm building my own lightsaber. Now there are four different lightsaber kind of paths that you can choose. There's Peace and Justice, Power and Control, Elemental Nature, and the Protection and Defense. I chose to go with Elemental Nature, so you guys know that's kind of like my background. So whenever you pick what you want, um, you're gonna pay up front at the cash register. Uh, it's gonna be $212, that includes tax. And then they're gonna give you a pin that is gonna coincide with whatever uh, lightsaber that you've chosen to build. So this is the one for the Elemental Nature. Um, just so you guys know, you can't walk around here and say that you're here to build a lightsaber because this is run by a bunch of gatherers and uh, this is kind of like a secret covert underground base to continue on with like uh, the ways of the force. So just kind of be careful. We don't want to uh, alert the first order of what's going on. Um, basically, if you, if you kind of like walk around, there's just like a bunch of scrap metal laying around and all over the place. So that is kind of, you're just here to sift through some scrap metal. And, uh, and build your lightsaber. So, pretty excited. Um, you can choose your own uh, kyber crystal inside. Looking forward to doing that. And uh, how many grown men have waited their entire lives to do something like this? I'm pretty excited. I'm almost like kind of getting the chills thinking about it. So, whew, can't wait. <laughs> We have a really good spot. Welcome to the workshop. I know it's a little, it's a lot, but to us, it is everything. Now to some of you, you may look around and see what appears to be like a lot of old junk, but let me clarify something. Some of this is new junk. Now you've met my fellow gatherers, and you may call me Kimbe. We humbly call ourselves the Gatherers. We search the farthest reaches of the galaxy for ancient artifacts. We search the forgotten places, abandoned outposts, battle-ravaged planets, and what we find, we bring back here. So where a stormtrooper would see worthless clutter, to those who know, they see priceless history. And in these troubled times, preserving our past may ensure our future. You've all heard the legend of Luke Skywalker, correct? Yes. Correct? Yes. yes. <laughs> well, we have caught wind of another one, a new Jedi. Anyone know her name? Ray. Ray, correct. You all know. And what Ray is leading is the spark of hope that many have been waiting for. And that is why you are here today, to look ahead and to build this. The lightsaber has been wielded by some of our greatest heroes and darkest enemies. It is elegant and enigmatic. To build a lightsaber is an art. The saber is a reflection of its builder with the force flowing between them, binding them. And today, you will feel that connection. But enough talk. Let us begin. And so, we begin perhaps the most important element of the lightsaber, the kyber crystal, able to focus the energy of the force to magnify it. Some say the kyber crystal is the heart of the lightsaber. 
The color of the crystal determines the color of the saber's blade. Blue. Wielded by the great master Obi-Wan Kenobi and his apprentice, Anakin Skywalker. And now, as we hear, rain. Green. Qui-Gon Jinn. Ahsoka, Tano, Master Yoda himself, and Luke Skywalker. The violet crystal, rare and beautiful like the one wielded by Mace Windu. And red, it has been called the color of power. The crystal of Darth Maul, Asajj Ventress, Darth Vader, and now, Kylo Ren. But these, these are stories of the past. And we are here for you, the future. The time has come for you to select your very own kyber crystal, the heart of your lightsaber. Builders, please close your eyes. Yes, close your eyes. And in your mind's eye, Picture your kyber crystal. What color do you see in your mind? What color calls to you? What color is yours? In your mind, select your kyber crystal. And remember, it is equally likely that the crystal is choosing you as well. Open your eyes and take your kyber crystal. of your lightsaber, the center of your control, and also the part that keeps your hand from being disintegrated. It's important. In front of you are the parts and pieces you have each selected. Review them carefully from left to right. Starting at the far left, you will find your chassis. Moving to the far right, you will find the activation plate. In the middle, you will find your bricks, public apps, and emitters. And just as you selected your very own kyber crystal, you will choose each and every part to make up your very own lightsaber. And the gatherers are here to assist you on this journey. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. yes. Very well. Let's as long as you match those two up together, it should be good. Let's go ahead and make sure to put the top point in the top circle and the bottom point. And just like that, use your left hand to guide it and your right hand to push it in, and it should be good. For activation plates, my friends, if you notice, there are red and blue squares inside your chassis, and of course, there are red and blue squares, at least inside one set, of your activation plates. As long as you go ahead and place blue and red, you should be good to go. That's okay. Excellent. Now, if you notice, there's a protruding ring, my friend. As long as you make sure this ring goes towards the center, it should be good. So, so it's something like this. Ring, ring, right in there. And of course, it's interchangeable, so it doesn't matter which one it goes towards, as long as these rings face the center, you're good to go. The emitter, comma, top and bottom of your light tube respectively. Oh, <laughs> we got an essential step. Did you tighten it? Yes. So of course, place these towards it. Give it a twist to the right, whichever two you find you like the most. Give it a twist to the right, so we're gonna go ahead and lock and secure in the place. Uh, yes. Are those the two that you want? 
It's okay if you don't want to change it. And he would know. He clearly went to Joy Depot and now it's probably a lot of decisions there too. So it's okay. It's okay. Which one do you like? This one like the way. Or like off. Oh. Should we get this going? Sorry. Can we let you know it's time to activate? Just slide that switch. Yeah, definitely that. I don't know what I'm trying to do. That looks like the one that looks cool. Mine is fine. Yeah, it's fine. A balance between power and control is important. Now take a moment to connect with your hilt. You have each just constructed your hilt, and nothing unexpected or traumatic has happened because why would it? <laughs> Which actually brings us to the most dangerous part of the process today. Builders, please leave your completed hilt and hilt saddle at your station and take a large step back. Gatherers, do your work. Now the gatherers are stabilizing each individual hyper crystal for activation. This is a dangerous process that requires years of training, a steady hand, and a lot of confidence. It's imperative. What's happening? Much skill have you shown. Chose it for yourself that you had. Now, join you will be. It is time. Master Yoda, it is indeed time to take that first step. We have reached the final stage in the process. The bond between Builder and Saber is about to be forged. So in a moment, you will step forward, place your hand on your hilt, and together on my signal, we will activate our Sabers together. Are you ready? Yes. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Very well, step forward, place your hand on your hilt, and wait for it. Just wait for it. Activate. <laughs> Build it. Raise your lightsabers. You have each just built a lightsaber. Like the Jedi and Sith who came before you. And like them, you too could change the galaxy. It only takes a spark. <laughs> Builders, please deactivate your sabers. The hardest part, I know. Ah, complete your lightsaber is. Now, your destiny you seek, your own path. Mm. May the force be with you. Master Yoda, thank you. In your hands, you each hold remarkable power. And remarkable power should not be dropped on the ground. <laughs> so we are pleased to present lightsaber sheets as you depart today. Our time awesome. is at an end, but your journey is just beginning. It is time to make your mark on the galaxy. And remember, you are each as unique and remarkable as the lightsabers you have constructed today. And who knows, maybe next time, we'll be telling your story. <laughs> Till the spire. Till the spire. This way we're What an amazing experience that was. It was, I had like the chills almost the whole time. Like just the, uh, uh, I don't even know what to say. Like it was just, it was awesome, it was incredible. And it's like, it's real. It's this like legit, it's awesome. Like it's pretty cool, it's pretty awesome. Uh, I would definitely recommend anybody who is like somewhat interested to do it, check it out, try it. It is expensive, but it's like, it's kind of like a once in a lifetime type of deal. I love it. It was awesome. So amazing. Presentation was great. And you know, it, you're not just going in there like all by yourself. Uh, what's really nice is they, they tell a story while you're in there doing it too, which is really cool. Um, that, you know, the gatherers go out to all of these planets that are either destroyed or ruined or whatever, and they are gathering pieces to make these lightsabers. Um, and they bring those back, and you know, the idea is that if 
um, the first order like kind of came in, they would just see useless junk lying around. But really, they keep the good stuff kind of like hidden underneath the tables, which is uh, which is really cool. So uh, they have people there who will help you along the way to build your lightsaber. Um, one thing that I have to tell you is that if you have OCD, this is going to be a struggle for you. At least with the elemental uh, nature, um, it's going to be a serious struggle for you just because it really feels like some stuff needs to line up and it doesn't. Um, I actually asked one of the Batu residents in there about it and uh, he said, you know, remember that this is stuff that they have salvaged and found so that doesn't necessarily all it's not always going to line up right but he's like if you use the force and really work hard you might be able to figure it out so i'm gonna have to go home and deconstruct and reconstruct but hey uh it was a lot of fun it was really cool this is definitely for the adult out there who has been wanting to do something like this their entire life definitely do it it's awesome so let us know if you plan on trying to build your own lightsaber here in batu uh and if if you are, what are you gonna build? Because it is an awesome experience. Comment down below. Get a picture and comment that down below. Let's see those awesome lightsabers you built.